Good morning, uh, Vern Bremer with uh, Fiat. I'm the engineering responsible for the uh, Fiat 500X in uh, NAFTA. And uh, today I'd like to just point out a couple things on the, uh, explain the all-wheel drive system. Uh, first of all, from a, a um, function standpoint, what we have is in the, in the uh, uh, front of the vehicle, we have a uh, disconnect at the uh, transmission. And what that allows us to do for fuel economy uh, is disconnect the all-wheel drive system at, at any point that it's not required. The car actually launches. It actually, when you take off uh, from a stoplight, it actually all-wheel drive is, is fully engaged. Then it'll sense the driving um, condition at a very fast rate um, and determine when to disconnect the rear axle. It also uses the ABS system in conjunction with the all-wheel drive and the, the central processor in the vehicle will take and, and again, it very quickly, uh, 500 milliseconds, it will take and sample the rate of wheel slip and tell where to supply the torque. From a safety, from a safety aspect, what this does uh, for the customer is, as you're driving, uh, you get into a condition where possibly you're in snow um, or on loose gravel, you come into a corner, it'll sense, it'll sense very quickly that you have wheel slip. It'll then apply the torque to the wheels to bring you back in line into a straight line of driving. In the 500X, the options that you're, that you're um, able to choose from is we have an auto mode, we have a traction plus mode, and we have a sport mode. In the auto mode, it's very much centered around daily driving, not in extreme conditions. The sport mode knows that you're at a higher rate of acceleration, much more aggressive shift points, and it'll keep the all-wheel drive system engaged longer. Plus, when it samples a little bit of wheel slip, it'll actually uh, apply torque much faster at a much faster rate. Traction Plus is much more for in the snow, snowy conditions, and it's, it's centered around the launching of the car in wet conditions. And what that means is the acceleration or the movement of the car. It'll actually start the vehicle in second gear to get the amount of wheel spin that you need to actually get the vehicle moving. And then, and then on, it, again, samples very quickly and, and will actually uh, distribute the torque much more quickly if it's uh, sensing that you're on ice or slippery conditions. We don't, have, we don't have the EPA labels yet, differences between, we don't have the EPA labels yet, the differences between the two, um, between a front wheel drive version and all wheel drive version. Um, but it is, it, it, with the disconnect, there's not much of a variance in the actual uh, on highway fuel, fuel economy. First of all, the, the, um, the vehicle is, stands in a segment on its own. It's very much centered around a CUV, has a large interior space, very nice, very nice driving dynamics on the highway. Uh, very good fuel economy. We're expecting labels in the numbers of 30 plus miles, north of 30 miles per gallon highway. The state of the art in this car is the uh, suspension tuning, the all wheel drive system, and the nine speed transmission. And also the safety features in this car. I mentioned them very, very shortly, but the safety features with the seven airbags, the uh, lane departure warning, the forward collision warning, the blind spot detection. I think, I believe there's 70 safety features in this vehicle. It's not a CVT. This is not continuous variable. It's nine specific gear ratios. And um, again, with the speed of the microprocessors today, it allows us, it really does allow us to keep it a very even engine RPM. Very, very, consistent engine RPM, thus saving fuel economy, uh, thus giving you the acceleration, very quick acceleration on the vehicle, uh, the responsiveness of the vehicle is better. On the 500X, there's only one, one size. Um, and uh, um, if you look at the design, it, it's, uh, you take the 500, the 500 is very, very small, not a four door uh, mini, mini, mini vehicle. This is much more slated towards a, 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 somewhere between a, a, a comp, comp, it's more of a compact CUV.